Okay, ICD-10 PCS, JJPCA guidelines, page 7023, and part 11. The physician is now expected to use the terms used in PCS code descriptions, nor is the coder required to query the physician when the corre correlation. correlation between the documentation and defined PCS terms is clear. All right. So, what it is saying here is, is the coder should know what words the physician uses and what those words correspond to the PCS uh, terms or code descriptions, right? Uh, for instance, there's an example there, right? Example, when the physician documents partial resection, the coder can independently correlate partial resection to the root operation excision without querying the physician for classification. So if the physician writes partial resection on the record, then the coder doesn't have to ask the physician, what, what do you mean by this? The coder automatically puts partial resection is an excision. Why? Because of this. Partial resection is cutting out or off without replacement a portion of a body part. And this is exactly the same as excision for PCS, right? So if the physician writes partial resection, the coder automatically has to change this for excision because that's what the physician means. Cutting out or off without replacement a portion of a body part. If it meant the whole body part, that's resection for PCS. That's not excision, that's resection, which is the whole body part. But since it's a portion of the body part, that's excision. The, in, in summary, the doctor writes, there was a partial resection, the coder automatically changes this for excision. And that the coder has to do it independently because the definitions are very clear. Excision is cutting out or off without replacement a portion of a body part, which is what the physician meant. Okay? And then uh, we have, again, the PCS structure here with the seven characters. The first one is? Section. The second one is? Body system. The third? Root operation. The fourth. Body part. Body part. The fifth. Approach. Sixth. Device. And seventh. Qualifier. Qualifier. Okay, we're going to be reviewing that over and over because that's the basis to understand PCS. Okay, that's our theory for today. Now we're going to do a problem. So ready, set, go. All right, PCS JJPCA, page 611, exercise 19, and this is a level one exercise, and it reads like this. Laparoscopic cholecystectomy. Laparoscopic cholecystectomy, right? So that's the problem, uh, that's the procedure, and now you have to find the PCS code for this, for a laparoscopic cholecystectomy. We're gonna count to three, so you can pause the video and then give us the PCS code for this procedure. One, two, three. Okay, the answer is zero FT4 for ZZ. Okay, zero FT4 for ZZ. You got that? If you got it, congratulations. If you didn't get it, let's give you a tip. All right, uh, a few tips. The first tip is Start with cholecystectomy. Cholecystectomy, because that's the main operation, right? That's the, the main procedure that, that was done. It's a cholecystectomy, means ectomy is excision, and cholecyst is a gallbladder. So it's an excision of a gallbladder, right? The second tip. Second tip is cholecystectomy means total removal of the gallbladder. In PCS language, total removal of an organ without replacing it is resection. Right. Why, why do we know it's a total removal? Because it doesn't say that it was part of it. If if it, if it had if it would have said part of the gallbladder, then we would know that that is part of it. But since it doesn't say that it was part, it's generally understood that it's the whole gallbladder. That's called a cystectomy. The, the, the whole colitis, which is means the, the gallbladder, has been ectomy or excited or taken off. Right? right. Okay. The third is. Since there is no mention of cutting off just part of the gallbladder, we assume it is all of the gallbladder. So it is a resection. Then this is what I, I was explaining, uh, exactly what I was explaining. Okay, with these three tips, you should be able now to get to the, the path 
to the answer because you know the answer already. The answer is a 0FT44ZZ. But what we want you to do now is pause the video and give us the path to the answer, how we got to the answer, okay? So one, two, three. All right, this is the summary of the whole problem. The problem is a laparoscopic cholecystectomy. There's only one code, and the code one through the index is found like this. First, you go to index. Uh huh. Then you go to cholecystectomy. You go to cholecystectomy, and they ask you to see what? Resection, gallbladder. Now, there's another part also that says excision of gallbladder. But since we explained before that uh, this is not excision because in the problem it doesn't tell us part of the gallbladder, but just gallbladder. So we assume that it's a resection of the gallbladder, right? So we go to the resection and... Resection, gallbladder. And then gallbladder, and we get... 0FT4. We get 0FT4. Okay, from the index we got 0FT4, right? So we're going to find the code through the tabular, right? Or double check the code through the tabular. So the code 1 through the tabular is found like this. First we go to tabular. Go to the tabular. Then we go to 0FT. You start with 0FT, which is the, the first three characters. And what is that? Medical and surgical. 0 is medical and surgical. That's 0. F is? F is hepatobiliary system. Yeah, right. The hepato and means liver, right? And, and pancreas. And pancreas. Okay, that, that's the body system. And uh, then uh, the T. What's the T? Resection. Resection, which is the root operation, right? Now we go adding one by one the characters. The next character is? That's four. Four for the body part, right? What is four? Four is a gallbladder. Gallbladder. Now one more character. One more character is four. Another four for, for what? For the approach, right? Yes. Which is? Percutaneous endoscopic. That's what we choose. Okay, now the next uh, character. Next character is Z. Z, because there's no device. We didn't leave anything on the body. And the last character? Is another Z. For no qualifier, because we don't need a, a, any extra code to describe this procedure. That's why we have an equal sign at the end, which means that we double check this code. So the answer is 0FT44ZZ. Okay? Thanks for watching, and please don't forget to visit our website. And also, and also you could subscribe, subscribe to us in YouTube by clicking here for our new medical coding videos. Right, in the rectangular, in the red rectangular, it says subscribe. You just click there, and then you get a notice in your email every time that we upload the videos. And what do we do every day? Uh, we make up to three videos every day. Mm -hmm. ICD tens, CPTs, all that is needed to pass the medical coding certification exams. Okay, so thanks for watching. So don't forget to visit our website and to subscribe to our videos. Thank you. Bye bye.